Hi everybody, my name is Chris from Reading Town and thank you for joining us today for Kids Times. Now today's topic are animals, right? Now animals, the animals themselves, they are important. But what's even more important is the different animals and where they live, they all are connected to each other. So the frog and the turtle, they are not separate but they live in the same place and that system, we call that an ecosystem, right? So an ecosystem is where, is a place where animals all live together, all right? So we're talking about a water ecosystem today. You can fish at the sea, river, or lake. 바다, 강, or 호수, you can fish, right? Some fish live in the sea, 바다 물고기, while others live in a river or a lake, uh, 강 물고기 or 호수 물고기, right? Sea has salt or 소금 in it, but rivers and lakes don't. We call sea like salt water and rivers and lakes fresh water or 민물, right? We call them sources of fresh water. We can drink it. Fish have fins uh, and breathe through their gills. So people, you and me, we have arms and we have fingers and hands, but fish don't have that. They have something called a fin, which helps them uh, swim and breathe through their gills over here, their jinnirami over here, right? However, a crawfish, this is a crawfish here. It looks like some sort of a shrimp through uh, crawls on the riverbed with legs, not fins. So fish, they have fins like this, but crawfish, they have legs. So they crawl or kyodengyo on the floor. A water strider, this bug here, glides and floats on the water. Glides means it goes very smoothly, like an ice skater, very smooth, shoo, and floats, dunda, on the water on water using fine hairs on its legs. So on its legs, on his legs, there are hairs. There's a little bit of tar on the legs and it helps him float on the water. So this is the water, it floats on the water and it glides like this, very smooth, right? We have three key questions here. A, some fish live in the sea. 어떤 물고기들은 바다에서 산다. While other fishes, 다른 물고기들은 they live in water that we can drink. 마실 수 있는 water in the rivers, in the kangs, or in the lakes, in the hoses. We say that is fresh water. So 민물 물고기's and seawater fish. B. Fish have blanks to swim. So different from people, you and me, we have arms and legs. Fish, they have something called fins. Fins are what's on side of them and on their tail and it helps them uh, swim in the ocean. Just like mermaids, the little mermaid didn't have legs. She had one big fin, right? See, a crawfish, the red looking thing, right? Looks like a seu, looks like a shrimp. Blanks on the river bed. So on the river bed, this is the floor on the bottom. It doesn't swim on the water. It slowly goes on the floor like a baby. When the baby is cannot walk, but the baby goes on the floor, we say that is crawling, kyodenginda, right? On the floor. Next one. We have three key grammar questions here. A. When you go blank you can go to a sea, right? So over here, we have something called a gerund. Okay, don't worry. A gerund is when we take a verb and we make it into a noun, right? So I'm gonna just say it here, fishing. So fishing here is not a verb. 낚시 하러 간다, right? It's not a verb here. This is 낚시 간다. So it's kind of a little uh, different thing here, but 
I'll, I'll give you an example, right? We say when you go swimming. We don't say when you go swim, right? When you go running, we don't say when you go run. When you go playing, that's okay. We don't say when you go play, right? B. So, uh, C, the C, water, has salt, blank, it, but rivers and lakes do not. So the C or the pada has salt, ane, right? Pada murun, sogumi, ane, tiroita. In the water, so we say in the water there is salt, right? We can find sogum inside or sogum uh, inside the water. C. A water strider, that insect that we saw before, right, that bug, strider glides and floats on the water, blank, fine hairs on its leg. Alright, so we're saying how. 어떻게 해서 this uh, insect can glide and um, float on the water? Well, it is using fine hairs. So on the legs, 다리에, there's 털, right? Hairs on it. So it is using fine hairs. So when we're talking about how, 어떻게 something is happening, we want to use the 현재 진행자, right? So for example, um, how is the car going, right? 어떻게 해서 자동차가 움직이나, right? How is it going? Well, it is using gas. The person is pushing the pedal. The person is driving the car, right? So when we say 어떻게 하는지 설명할 때, we use the 현재 진행사, use ing, play ing, or step ing, or turn ing, all right? So to review, fishing is what we call a gerund. This is a 명사 here, right? It's not a verb. Uh, in is 소금 물 안에 소금이 있다, right? It's inside the water. And when we are explaining how to do something, 어떻게 하는지 설명할 때는 we use the present progressive or the 현재 진행사. All right. So next time you go to the ocean and the next time you go to the river, see what's different about the animals, see what's different about the water. All right. So thank you for joining us today for Kids Times. My name is Chris from Reading Town. I'll see you next time.